हॅलो स्टुडंट्स मायसेल्फ डॉक्टर सुभाष सोनाळे असिस्टेट प्रोफेसर डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ मॅथमॅटिक्स टुडे वी आर गोईंग टू डिस्कस वन इम्पॉर्टंट टॉपिक डिफरन्सिअल इक्वेशन ॲज द डिफरन्सिअल इक्वेशन ॲज मेनी ॲप्लिकेशन्स इन सायन्स इन कॉमर्स मॅनेजमेंट इन एन्व्हायरमेंटल सायन्सेस so first of all we will def- uh, we will define the differential equation the differential equation and equation involving derivatives is called differential equation that is an equation involving derivatives of dependent variable with respect to one or more independent variable is called differential equation here uh, we are uh, aware about the dependent variable and independent variable so suppose uh, Uh, p is the price and d is the demand as we know the price is depends on demand d so we say p is the uh, dependent variable and demand d is the independent variable so here we can uh, understood what is the dependent variable and what is the independent variable and these are the some examples uh, dy by dx is equals to 2x plus 3y this is the differential equation and derivative of y with respect to x dy by dx is the differential uh, coefficient and then uh, we can see the second example also dy by dx is equals to x plus y the whole square dy by dx the whole square is uh, plus 4y dy by dx is equals to zero so these are the some examples of differential equations now we see the types of differential equation we have mainly two types of differential equation that is the ordinary differential equation and partial differential equation first we see what is the ordinary differential equation a differential equation involving derivative of dependent variable with respect to one or more independent with respect to one and only one independent variable is called ordinary differential equation these are the example of ordinary differential equation dy by dx is equals to 2x plus 3y this is the differential equation involving derivative of y with respect to x only and uh, dy by dx the whole square plus 4 dy by dx is equals to 0 is also ordinary differential equation now we see the second type of differential equation that is the partial differential equation a differential equation involving derivative of dependent variable with respect to more than one independent variable is called partial de- differential equation these are the some examples of partial differential equation here we can see the derivative of uh, y dependent variable y is with respect to x and t that means with respect to two independent variable also in second example we can see the derivative of dependent variable y with respect to x and t so here in partial differential equation derivative of dependent variable is with respect to more than one independent variable then another important part is the order and dif- uh, degree of the differential equation first we define what is the order of differential equation so order of differential equation is the order of highest order derivative involved in the equation and second is the degree of differential equation so degree of differential equation is the power of highest derivative involved in the equation when the equation is free from the fraction now we see some examples how to find the order and Uh, degree of the differential equation so the first uh, example dy by dx is equals to 2x plus 3y so here we have to see the order first order of the derivative and then the power of the highest order derivative so this is the differential equation of order 1 and degree 1 dy by dx first order differential equation and its power is also 1 so we say this is the differential equation of order 1 and degree 1 then the second example dy by dx the whole square plus 4 dy by dx is equals to 0 so this is the differential equation with order 1 and degree 2 as the uh, power of dy by dx is 2 then we have another example do 2y by do x square plus do 2y by do t square the whole cube is equals to 4 here we can see the highest order derivative is 2 and power of the highest order derivative is 3 so this is the differential equation of order 2 and degree 3 next we can see the two types of solutions for the differential equation so first is the uh, solution general solution is solution of differential equation involving the arbitrary constants is called uh, general solution and uh, particular solution after eliminating the arbitrary constants uh, from uh, the general solution by using the initial condition we get the particular solution for the differential equation then we have the different methods for solving the differential equation so first method is the variable separation method 
So the first order differential equation dy by dx is equal to f of xy is called separable uh, equation. If function f of xy can be factored into pro product of two functions of x and y, the, as f of xy is equal to gx into hy. So gx is a function of x, hy is the function of y, and we write uh, this equation as dy by dx is gx into hy. That is dy by hy is equals to dx into x so which is in separable form as function of y with dy and function of x with dx and integrating it we get the general solution uh, where c is the constant of integration now we can see some examples by using this variable separation method how to find the general solution of the differential equation so first example solve the differential equation dy by dx is equals to y upon x so first we uh, write this differential equation in variable separable form so function uh, y with dy and x with this uh, with dx by separating variables so dy by y is equals to dx by x so this is the differential equation in uh, variable separable form and integrating on both the sides we get the general solution so integration of dy by y is equals to integration of dy by x is plus c where c is the constant of integration and after integrating we know ln y is equals to ln x plus ln c so y is equals to x into c is the general solution of this differential equation also we can solve the differential equation second uh, two times dy by dx is equals to y times x plus one divided by x so by separating the variables uh, we can write the function of y along with dy and function of x along with the dx so 2 dy by y is equals to 1 plus 1 upon x dx so which is in variable separable form and integrating it we get the general solution 2 times dy by y is equals to 1 plus 1 upon x dx plus c so then after uh, simplifying it we get the general solution as 2 ln y is equals to x plus ln x plus c so which is the general solution of this differential equation similarly we can solve another differential equation sin 2y dy minus cos x dx is equals to 0 so here again we can uh, separate the variables sin 2y dy is equals to cos x dx is in variable separable form integrating this we get the general solution sin 2y dy is equals to integration of cos x dx plus c c is the constant of integration and integrating it we get the general solution 1 by 2 cos of 2y is equals to sin x plus c now we see the second method that is the homogeneous differential equation method so a differential equation is said to be homogeneous that standard form is dy by dx is equals to f of xy is homogeneous differential equation if f of tx ty is equals to t raised to n f of xy where t is any real number it belongs to r and power of t is called uh, homogeneous uh, degree degree of the homogeneous equation so for example if f of xy is equals to x square plus y square we can see the whether this uh, function is homogeneous function or not for that we replace x and y by tx ty so we can find the power of t so we here we see is uh, equals to t square x square plus y square that is t square f of xy so we say that f of tx ty is equals to t square f of xy so 2 is the uh, degree of this homogeneous equation equation so this function is homogeneous and homogeneous of degree 2 now we see the homogeneous differential equation method for the solution of uh, differential equation so first we convert this homogeneous differential equation into variable separable form by putting y is equals to vx that is dy by dx is equals to v plus x dv by dx and integrating it separating the variables for v and x and integrating it we get the general solution here we see one example solve the homogeneous differential equation dy by dx is equals to x square plus y square divided by xy so this differential equation is homogeneous by inspection we can see uh, degree is 2 now by using homogeneous method we can solve this differential equation so first to convert into homogeneous equation we put y is equals to vx that is dy by dx is v plus x dv by dx and um, separating the variables we get the differential equation in variable separable form 
दैट इज एक्स डी वी बाई डी एक्स इज इक्व टू वन अपॉन वी नाउ वी सेपरेट द वेरिएबल्स फॉर एक्स एंड वी सो अलॉन्ग विद द डी वी वी कैन राइट द फंक्शन ऑफ वी अलॉन्ग विद द एक्स वी राइट डी एक्स वी राइट द फंक्शन ऑफ एक्स सो दैट इज वी स्क्वेयर बाय टू इज इक्व टू एल एन एक्स प्लस सी दिस इज द सोल्यूशन ऑफ डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन आफ्टर इंटीग्रेटिंग नाउ आवर डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन इज इन एक्स एंड वाई सो आवर सोल्यूशन मस्ट बी इन एक्स एंड वाई सो वी पुट वाई वी इज इक्व टू वाई अपॉन एक्स इन दिस इक्वेशन वी गेट द जनरल सोल्यूशन एज वाई स्क्वेयर डिवाइड बाई टू एक्स स्क्वेयर इज इक्व टू एल एन ऑफ एक्स प्लस सी सो दिस इज द सोल्यूशन ऑफ डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन सो दीज आर दी सम ऑफ द मेथड्स फॉर द सॉल्विंग डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन सिमिलरली वी कैन ट्राई फॉर द सेकेंड एग्जाम्पल सॉल्व द डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन विच इज होमोजीनियस डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन एंड इन सिमिलर वे बाई पुटिंग वाई इज इक्व टू वी एक्स एंड यूजिंग दी होमोजीनियस फॉर्म वी कन्वर्ट इट इन टू वेरिएबल सेपरेशन एंड सेपरेटिंग द वेरिएबल्स वी गेट इट्स जनरल सोल्यूशन थैंक यू सो मच